It's hand paint day at school today. I have brought my favorite paint brushes today. Star shaped, heart shaped, and candy shaped. <laughs> but Mr. Todd the turtle told us that we will be using our hands to paint. Oh, okay. Then I will use my hands to paint. <laughs> Look at my paint box. It has every color in the world. Wow. <coughs> Good morning, children. Good, Good morning, morning, Mr. Todd. <laughs> Today, two new kids will be joining us. Two new kids. Are they spiders? No, no, no. I'm so scared of spiders. Is it a bird? <laughs> Come on in, kids. Meet Luna the lion and Jenny the giraffe. Go on then. Make new friends. Hi, I am Luna. Hi, Luna. Hi, Jenny. I'm Bud. Hi. She's a bit shy. <laughs> Come on, kids, let's go out and paint! Yay! Yeah, yes! Jenny, come paint with us! Mm -hmm. Let me try. Jenny, you can use my colors if you want. is about to be complete, Mr. Todd. Mm -hmm. It looks awesome. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, my painting. Uh-oh. Oops. Uh, I can help. Help. Wow. wow. <laughs> That's right. Giraffes have long necks. Oh. oh, I see. Good job, Jenny. <laughs> Are all the children out of the bus? Yes, yes Mr. Mr. Todd. Todd. Oh, great. Let's begin the space adventure journey at Paso. How exciting! Come on in, kids. Mr. Wolf will take us around different planets. Mr. Wolf is my dad. He has been to the space many times. <gasps> really? He's lying. Yes. In fact, my collar is made of Saturn's rings. I told you he's lying. Why don't you believe me? Hello, children. Welcome to space. Are you ready for space adventure? Yes. yes. I'm scared. There's no need to worry, Ginny. Space is the coolest thing ever. Come on, it will be fun. Can anyone tell me the name of this planet? It's Mercury. It's the closest planet to the sun. It's very hot there too. And this is Venus. My dad told me my mom is from Venus. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's proceed. Our Earth is the only planet in the universe with life on it. That's correct. Good job, Luna. Uh, Mr. Wolf. Are there any giraffes on other planets? Uh, no. Um, what about elephants? Um, we haven't found any yet. <laughs> <laughs> this is Mars. It's our neighbor. Just like Ginny. She's my neighbor too. That's correct, Luna. Uh, Jupiter is the largest planet in our solar system. You are a bright girl, Ginny. Ginny the genius. <laughs> Moving on. Saturn has many rings. They are made of rocks. And Dago got his collar from Saturn. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I told you. 
Mr. Wolf, may I talk too? Go ahead, Luna. <laughs> Uranus is a planet very far, far away. One year on Uranus is equal to 84 years on the Earth. Okay. That's correct, Luna. 84 years. Now, did you know that Neptune is the farthest known planet in the solar system? Daddy, have you ever visited Neptune? Not yet, son. Look, everyone. I have reached Neptune. <laughs> Kids, are you ready for the fun part? Yes. I know I am. What's the fun part? We are going to become astronauts. That's right, doggo. Kids, have you ever wondered what it would feel like to go and travel to the moon? Yes, if we go to the moon, there will be less gravity and we will be able to jump really high. <laughs> Jenny, you are a genius. Come on, kids, put on your astronaut suits and get in the anti-gravity chamber. Anti-gravity anti chamber? That's right, kids. Just like on the moon, you can jump really high in the anti-gravity chamber. This feels like I'm on a trampoline. We all like jumping up and down, up and down and up and down. Guys, I'm a bit nervous. What will happen if I pull this lever? What are you doing, doggo? Oh, this is fun! Ah, 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 ah. Doggo, Doggo, stop! Doggo, what are you doing? Pull the lever back! <laughs> Sorry, Dad! Daddy, what is a helicopter? A helicopter is like a car with a fan on the top. But how does it fly? Um, well, when we turn the fan on, the air pulls the helicopter up and we fly. Wow, Daddy, you are a genius! <laughs> Remember to fasten your seatbelt, bud, when you sit inside the helicopter. Just the way you put your seatbelt in the car. Okay, Mommy and Daddy. Well, hello, Mr. and Mrs. Elephant. Greetings, little bud. Good, Good morning, morning Mrs. Todd. Greetings, Mrs. Todd. Are the three of you ready for takeoff? Oh, none about! I'm going to fly! I'm going to fly! Hop in! Mrs. Todd, how does a helicopter fly? It's simple, bud. We press the fan button, and then the start button, and then the fly button. And off we go! <laughs> so, where do you want to go, bud? First, I want to go up. And now down. And now, round and round and round and round. Whoa! Look out the window. We have found a spiral cloud. Oh, that's nothing. We can make any shape you want. Like a square. Or a circle. Um, or a triangle. Can you make an elephant? I can try. Look, Daddy, look! It's you! Oh, 
It's me! <laughs> I am ready for my pie. Doggo. Yes, mommy. Huh? Where did my pie go? Cheese. Where's my cheese? Where's my cheese? Here's my cheese. Thank you, Mommy. I love cheese. Oh, where's my cheese? Bud, I got some strawberries for you from the market. I love strawberries, Mommy. Strawberries are my favorite fruit. But where did my strawberries go? Now, boys, I have called this important meeting because my cheese just went missing. Huh? That's weird. My pie also went missing. Someone stole my strawberries, too. What should we do now? I have an idea. What's wrong? I hear some strange sounds from this room. I sense that there has been a theft in my presence. Yes, Daddy. What were you doing? Doggo spy, but strawberries and my cheese have gone missing. Don't you worry, Miller. I'm going to solve this case. Come on, we should find clues. Where was your cheese stolen from, Miller? Right here, Daddy. <gasps> Look at that. It's a half-eaten piece of your cheese, Miller. We should go back to my house and check for other clues. That's right, bud. Let's go. Look at that. It's, it's a half-eaten half piece of strawberry. strawberry. It was my strawberry. Don't worry, bud. We are going to find the thief. I think the thief was very hungry. That's why he has stolen all of our food. You are a bright young girl, Miller. Now, let's go and find some witnesses. Look, those are footprints. Footprints? Footprints! Let's follow these footprints! Good job, kids! Come on, let's follow them! Yay! We are following the thief's footsteps! But what will we do once we find the thief? I think we should ask him for all of our stuff! <laughs> Look at that! It's a little baddie! We apologize, Miss Birdie. We are actually trying to find a thief. A thief? What kind of a thief? We are trying to find someone who stole my pie, Bud's strawberries, and Miller's cheese. Did you just say strawberries? Yes, yes we did. You are in luck today. I just found a strawberry half eaten near this tray. <gasps> half eaten, eaten strawberry? Well, kids, looks like we have found your thief. I'll get the thief out of this tray. Don't you worry. Well, hello. I am Mr. Squeak. How can I help you? Mr. Squeak, you're a bad, bad squirrel. Well, what did I do? You stole our strawberries, our cheese, and our pies. Well, I didn't steal anything. That's not true. Your face is covered in strawberry. Oops. 
Hurry up, Mommy. We will be late. Yes, dear. Hi, Bud. Hi, Mrs. Trumpet. Hi, Hi Doggo. Hello, Mrs. Trumpet. Are you also dropping Bud at Ginny's place for pool games? Yes. Yes, she is, Mr. Woof. Ha <laughs> ha All right, then have fun. Bye, Mommy. Bye, Daddy. Welcome home, kids. Where are you, Mr. Giraffe? I can't see you. Up here. Wow, you are so tall. <laughs> Whoa, Mila and Luna are already here. Oops, I keep falling down. I wonder how fishes walk with such feet. They don't walk, Luna. They swim. Just like me. I swim, 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 swim. I swim, 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 swim. Hi, Bud and Doggo. Hi, friends. Hi. See how we swim? Swish, 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 swish. Hi, Bud and Doggo. You both are so late. They are always late. Attention, kids. The pool games are about to begin. The, the pool, pool games. games? The pool games are very simple, yet very competitive. In the first game, you have to take the balloon from one side to the other. That's so easy. Look at me go. I won. <laughs> Although that was great, Miller. It doesn't have to be done like that. So you have to push the ball by blowing onto it. By blowing onto it? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, kids. Are you ready? Let's start. One, two, three. Good job, bud. Go, bud. Splendid performance, bud. Now it's time. Time for what? This time we'll divide in two teams. Every team will have to throw the ball towards the other team. And we have to try that the other team does not catch the ball. Wow, that sounds fun. Can we select our own teams? Those who want to be in my team, raise your hands. Guys, didn't raise your hands. Miller, you can't play ball. That's true, Miller. You are a terrible player. <laughs> That's not true. I'm a very good player. You'll see. Hmm. Bud, come with me. And Ginny, come with me. Bud, Ginny, and I are on one team. And Dogo and Luna, you can be on the other team. Uh-oh. It's my turn to throw now. Let me. No, I'll do it. Wait. <laughs> See, I told you, I'm a better player than any of you. Look, it's starting to rain. That's not rain. Then what is it? It's my daddy's surprise. <coughs> this is the best summer ever. <laughs> <laughs> but and Doggo arrive at the train station with Mrs. Woof. They are all excited to go on a train journey to Venice. <laughs> Mommy, how far is Venice? It takes a long time to get to Venice, Doggo. We will be there by tomorrow morning. Tomorrow, tomorrow morning? morning. <laughs> Look, here comes the train. Have fun, kids. 
I want to sit by the window. No, I want to sit by the window. <laughs> you both can sit by the window. There are two seats. Uh... Choo choo goes the train, choo choo goes the train. It takes us all around the world, it's true. Choo choo goes the train, choo choo goes the train. It takes us all around the world, it's true. <laughs> Look at that, it's a cow shaped tree. Look at that, it's a tree shaped cow. <laughs> Supper is here. Mm, it smells so good. But where will we eat it? We just have to tap this button. Uh, There's no apple pie, only soup and vegetables. Vegetables? Ugh. If you eat your vegetables, you will get some cake for dessert. <laughs> now here's your dessert. Huh? Attention, we are entering a tunnel. Huh? It has all gone dark. What are you doing, Doggo? Doggo! Oops. Doggo, you are a bad little boy. Sorry, Mommy. Look, we're on a bridge. Well, we are on top of a mountain, Mommy. Hmm, but it's getting dark now. Both of you, get to bed. Will we sleep, Mrs. Boo? Right here. Good night, Mommy. Good night, Mrs. Boo. Mommy, the ground is gone. Where did it go? Our train has become a boat, kids. We have reached Venice. <laughs> I can't see the ground anywhere. That's because Venice is built on water. Ooh. Where are we going first, Mommy? First, we are going to the Venice Bridge. What's the Venice Bridge? It's a bridge in Venice! Uh, Mr. Lion, what's a Venice Bridge? <laughs> uh, the Venice Bridge is a place where you can make a wish. Hmm, making a wish? I'm going to wish for Miller to come to Venice. And I'm going to wish for pies. <laughs> We have arrived! Wow! It's so big! Now kids, you take a leaf from the tree, make a wish, and throw it in the water. <laughs> that sounds so exciting! But your wish came true! Look, there's Miller! <gasps> Miller? <laughs> Excuse me, I am not this Miller. I am Miller. Don't lie, Miller. We can see that it's you. You look exactly like Miller. Huh? But that's not possible. I am Miller. I live here, in Venice. Uh, okay. Our friend Miller likes cheese. I love cheese too. <laughs> Kids, now we should go and explore the city. Okay, mommy. Bye, Millar. Bye, friends. It was nice to meet you. <laughs>
Finally, it was so nice to meet you. Bye. 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 You can buy plenty of gifts for your loved ones over here. Mrs. Woof, I want to buy a present for Mummy Daddy. All right, bud. We can all stop here and buy presents. Uh, I want to gift myself something too. Maybe a pie? <laughs> Don't you worry, Doggo. I will buy some pie for both of you. Pie time! This, this looks, looks tasty. tasty. Mommy, the pie here has spaghetti in it. I love it. Mmm, <laughs> <laughs> I'm so full. Me too. Here is a gift shop. Here is where you can buy old presents. Look, Mr. Lion, I got so many lovely things. Look, it's a scarf for Mommy and Little Venice for Daddy. There's one more thing. What? This picture reminds you of the happy memories from Venice. <laughs> tra -la -la, tra -la -la. <laughs> what are you laughing about, Mr. Squeak? Oh, I'm sorry. It was funny. Are you okay? I'm fine. Something hit me when I was flying. Oh, I think it was a big beanstalk. Oh, it seems quite big. I wonder what's at the top. You know... I'm hoping for walnuts. Well, why don't you try climbing? Me? No. I'm scared. I'm running faster than both of you. <laughs> Wait for me. I'm just letting you win. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Squeak and Miss Birdie. Well... Well, oh, hello! And Miller. Hi! Will the three of you like to climb the beanstalk with us? Wow! That's a huge beanstalk! It's so hard to climb this! It will be so much fun! We should do it! Yeah, I know. This will be hard to do. That's why I don't want to do it alone. <laughs> we'll go with you. Come on, guys, let's go. I fly. I fly above the sky. <laughs> I'm tired. It's not too far now. Mr. Squeak, why are you so slow? Squirrels are supposed to climb fast. I am just scared, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> wow, this door is huge. Well, how will we go past it? Follow me! Oh no. Please, I'm scared. This was a stupid idea. <laughs> what are you little oh, children oh, doing? Mr. Giant sees you, he will eat you. Huh? He will eat us? Yes, he loves to eat children. But we are sad and hungry, Mrs. Giant. <sighs> oh. Let me get you get something to eat. Fee fi fu fum. I can smell children. I'm going to eat them. Ah! 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 Please don't eat us, please, please don't eat us. We're 
they're dead now. Where are all the children? We are not humans. Oh, you're not humans. So you are welcome to my home. Oh, in that case, can you give me some walnuts to eat? Shh, shh, Mr. Squeak, shh, shh. <laughs> sure. You're not scary at all, Mr. Giant. Just because I'm big doesn't mean I have to be scary, children. Oh. I'm so full. I don't feel like going back down. Yeah. We got tired climbing up. Tired? Why didn't you use the lift? The lift? Oh, I remember seeing a button on the beanstalk. Mr. Mr. Squeak! Squeak. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, it's getting cold. Hmm, we should get our sweaters out. But... Yes, Mommy? But it's getting cold. We should all get our jackets, sweaters, and mufflers out. Mommy, why does it get cold every year? <laughs> because the sun goes a bit far away from us. Oh, wow. So when it's summertime, does the sun come back closer? Yes, dear. That's exactly what happens. Now, come on. We should get our sweaters out. This is my favorite sweater, bud. Daddy, you can't fit in that sweater. Now I can't, but when I was your age, I would wear it all the time. It was my favorite sweater. Oh, but it could fit me. Ha <laughs> ha, yes, bud, you can keep it. I want to wear it right now. But it's going to get warmer, dear. You will start sweating. No, I want to wear this all day. Bud. The sweater will make you feel warm. I promise it won't, Mommy. It's too cold. Winter is here. May I please go now and play with my friends? Okay. okay. Hi, Hi, Bud. Bud. Hi, Doggo. Hi, Miller. Why are you wearing a sweater, Bud? It's so warm. It's my daddy's sweater from when he was a child. I'm going to wear it all day. But it's such a sunny day. Why are you wearing a sweater? Hello, Mr. Sun. It wasn't so warm before you arrived. Mr. Sun, why are you so far today? Oh, it's because winter is coming. And that's why I'm wearing the sweater. It's a little doggy! Quack, 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 quack! Quack, 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 quack! Quack, quack, quack! My cola is finished! I'm gonna go and get some more! Do you kids want some too? Yes, yes Mr. Sun! Come with me! It's getting so warm. I need that cola now. It's not that warm. Bud, you're sweating. Take that sweater off. No, I'm fine. <laughs> Are we almost there yet? Almost. Wait. It's too what, bud? Fine, it's too hot. <laughs> Happy Diwali, Daddy. Happy Diwali, bud. What are you doing, Dad? I am lighting the lamps. 
And you, you should go and help your mommy out. Okay, Daddy. Mommy, how can I help you to decorate the house? Hmm, you love colors. Maybe you can go outside and make a rangoli. That's a great idea, Mommy. Hi, Doggo. Hi, bud. Let's make a rangoli. I have a better idea. Hmm? Eh, 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 eh. What are you doing, Doggo? This is not a rangoli. Eh, eh. It looks so good. I'm winning. No, I'm winning. This is such a fun game. Show me, show me. I want to see it too. Huh? What have you done? Eh, eh. It's our rangoli. We can play with it too. Miller, why are you alone? Where are Ginny and Luna? They should be here soon. But first, happy Diwali! Happy, happy Diwali. Diwali! We are here, guys. Happy Diwali! Happy, happy Diwali, Diwali, Luna and Ginny! <laughs> <laughs> we all look so wonderful in these Diwali dresses. When will we get all the sweets? <laughs> as soon as we finish the decorations. I want to start with the fireworks. No, bud, you can only do it with your parents. We are tiny children, and it's not safe for us to light them without a parent. That's true, bud. Oh, mommy! Happy Diwali, children! Happy, Happy Diwali, Diwali, Mr. and Mrs. Mrs. Trumpet. Trumpet! We want you to light the fireworks now. Can we do it, please? Of course, children. You can all come here one by one to light the rockets. Yay! <gasps> Look at that! Wow! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that! Mine was the prettiest one. No, mine! Wow! Ho 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 ho!